State Senator Simha Felder, a key Democrat who sits with the GOP, insists he is not holding up a state budget over education issues at yeshivas despite directing Speaker Carl Heasty indicating otherwise. Felder spoke to the press on Friday, March 30, 2018. Watch it. Albany, a battle over education curriculum for yeshivas and other non-public schools threatened to derail hopes of an on-time state budget as Governor Andrew Cuomo and top state lawmakers tried to salvage a last-minute deal. Assembly Speaker Carl Heasty, D. Bronx, issued a statement Friday morning blaming the budget stalemate on the Senate Republicans' push for a measure that would relax education requirements for yeshivas, Jewish religious schools, and similar institutions. Heasty told reporters that the yeshiva education issue is the final sticking point in negotiations over how to spend more than $160 billion for the state's next fiscal year, which begins Sunday. This issue should not be the reason that there should be a government shutdown, said Heasty, who said he's not interested in passing a short-term budget to avoid a shutdown. The Senate returned to session midday to pass another budget bills, but a final agreement remained unresolved heading into the late afternoon. At issue was the measure is being pushed by a key vote in the state Senate, Senator Simha Felder, a Brooklyn Democrat who sits with Republicans, giving the GOP a one-vote majority in the chamber. Heasty said the Assembly's Democratic majority is unwilling to include the measure in any budget agreement, arguing it could cause harm to children who attend such schools. Felder, who is Jewish and represents a district that is heavily Jewish, disputed the notion that he's holding up the budget, though he declined to elaborate on what he's specifically seeking for yeshivas. I'm not Moses, he told reporters Friday. I'm not Jesus. I don't have that kind of power. Lawmakers would likely have to approve the budget this afternoon in order to have a budget in place on time. For Jewish lawmakers, Passover begins at sundown. For Christian lawmakers, it's Good Friday with Easter on Sunday. I guarantee you it's not going through the weekend, Senator John DeFrancisco, R. Syracuse, a Republican candidate for governor, said. It's whatever we get done by the time we've got to get done today is what we're going to get done. The legislature approved three relatively uncontroversial budget bills late Thursday and in the wee hours of Friday, though a handful of weightier bills remain. At least three have yet to be introduced. Heasty shifted the focus to the Senate Republicans when asked whether he would be willing to shut down state government if the GOP were unwilling to relent on the yeshiva issue. That would be they, Senate GOP, would be willing to shut down the government, Heasty said. The state education department said Friday it continues to work an advisory group on how to reform policies that govern the educational standards of religious schools. The agency cautioned it may be too soon to put potential changes into law, applauding the reluctancy of Heasty and Assembly Education Chairwoman Kathy Nolan, D. Queens, to go ahead with Felder's position. The purpose of updating the guidance is to ensure that all New York State students, whether they attend a public or non-public school, receive a quality education, the department said in a statement.
We thank Speaker Heasty and Chair Nolan for standing up for all New York's children. Includes reporting by the Albany Bureau's Joseph Spector and Natasha Vaughn.